Hi guys. <clears throat> well, <laughs> yeah, I am again getting in uh, <laughs> back back in the in the fucking twilight zone. So where I am right now on this lovely, gloomy uh, <clears throat> Thursday afternoon, January. 18th 2024 is uh is is at the habitat for humanity restore in uh in crystal river florida where pretty much every fucking every fucking uh <clears throat> parking spot is full uh, on a goddamn rainy ass Thursday afternoon and I'm thinking well this is a good sign uh, you know the, the, these habitat restores <clears throat> is every one of them is individually owned and operated so it's the individual store manager who who sets the the goddamn prices uh, th you know th this is all over the fucking country so, uh, I guess I've just been spoiled in, in, in fucking Ithaca, New York. You, you think that Ithaca, New York would be, uh, you know, on, on the high end of, the, uh, of these goddamn uh, Habitat for Humanity restore price ranges. Uh, so, they have one down in Inverness. <clears throat> And, and so I go into that one, and I'm thinking, what the fuck? Uh, <clears throat> you know, what's the point uh, of, of buying from the Habitat Humanity Restore? Uh, th that is just like walking in a fucking mall, uh, you know, Home Depot or Lowe's. And so I did not even realize that right down the street was a whole nother... <clears throat> Habitat for Humanity Restore in, in Crystal River. So I, go, so I saw all the fucking cars, and so I'm thinking, all right, maybe uh, I, I'll get some fucking, uh, get back to goddamn planet Earth. Well, I pull up to the place, and I start seeing all kinds of shit that we could use around that trailer. So there are these two grills out front, these two used uh, propane grills. Said, so, well, you know, we need a, a damn grill around there. Uh, so in, in, in Ithaca, the normal price uh, on these goddamn used grills uh, are usually in the 40 to, well, I would say in the 30 to $50 range uh, that you go in and buy one of these fucking new grills. So I, I'm thinking, okay. Hey, get, get us a grill, 30 to 50 bucks. I get out the fucking car. Look at the goddamn, uh, look at the goddamn grill. The fucking thing is $200. 200 fucking dollars. Uh, you know, to buy someone else's fucking garbage. Uh, that they that they threw away. Uh, good fucking god, two hundred fucking dollars uh, for the same grill that would have cost forty fucking bucks in in, uh, in in Ithaca. So then I I go in and 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 they're saying, you know, I'm looking at because they usually have a fifty percent off thing. So fifty percent off on table lamps and wall art and i'm saying all right we need three table lamps and probably four or five more you, you know little five dollar uh pictures so 50 percent off i'm thinking I, i'm thinking i'm looking there's a shitload of wall art there's a shitload of fucking table lamps so uh, i walk up to the first table lamp you know, at 50% off, and so I'm picking, I'm saying, well, this is probably a $10 lamp. Uh, so, I, so I'm in the fucking Habitat Restore, 
thinking, okay, well, this is a $10 lamp, so I guess uh, I'll pay $5 for the thing. I pick it up, it's $100, 100 fucking dollars. $100 fucking dollars is, is the price uh, on this beat up old used lamp. Is that like 50% off that the fucking thing is 50 fucking dollars? And I'm, I'm going up and down the rack. The, the, the vast majority of their lamps, uh, they have 45 fucking dollars. So, you know, $22.50 uh, on, on a fucking lamp that probably is $29 at Lowe's or Home Depot. And, and, and you get probably the same fucking lamp at Walmart is less than twenty two fifty, and then I go over to the fucking wall art, uh, in, in that entire goddamn trailer, uh, several of those things I've gotten for free, I have not paid more than ten dollars. Uh, for a single piece of that wall art uh, in, in that trailer. is the most expensive fucking piece of wall art that I have in that trailer. is a $10 bill. I go over there. Well, uh, pretty much all of their wall art is $30 fucking dollars. So you take half of that, so $15 fucking dollars. Fifteen fucking dollars uh, for for something uh, th that should be about three fucking dollars. You know who the fuck do they think is buying this shit? And, and then I see a, 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 a goddamn nightstand. I said, well, that's that's a pretty good look, looking little nightstand. Uh, let's see. I, I, I'm thinking, you know, thirty bucks for the nightstand. I go over to the fucking nightstand. A fucking little nightstand, you know, that, that, that sits beside your bed. Uh, $125 fucking dollars. $100, not $25, $125. I'm, I'm thinking, did I just miss, did they just misplace one of the, one of the goddamn, uh, you know, lines through the dollar sign? Jesus fuck I mean who the fuck are they kidding? 125 fucking dollars for a nightstand. Then I go back you know to the like uh, the plumbing and hardware and that kind of thing. Well I need a fucking toilet seat. I, I go and look. So it is a new toilet seat, okay, guys? At least it's not a used toilet seat. So I, so I see one, and, it, and it's one of these old ones that I'm thinking, uh, there's a pretty good chance that this will actually fit. Uh, so at least I can pick up a $5 fucking uh, toilet seat at Habitat for Humanity. This would have been a $5 bill in Ithaca, New York. Pick the fucking thing up, 30 fucking dollars 30 dollars for a fucking plastic toilet seat and what the fuck 30 fucking dollars so i've been going to lowe's i see if i get the same motherfucking toilet seat at fucking lowe's uh for ten dollars cheaper uh, than, than this fucking thing at, at, at Habitat for Humanity. Who's going to pay 30 fucking dollars for, for a fucking plastic toilet seat at Habitat for Humanity? I mean, what the fuck? And uh, that was obviously uh, when I got the fuck out of Habitat for Humanity. Jesus fucking Christ. Uh, well, I will have my little Habitat for Humanity restore in uh, Ithaca, New York, waiting for me in May, I guess. All right. I am going to have me some fine Mexican food to get over the sticker shock. They probably have a new menu where they're fucking... Uh, Nine dollar burrito is fucking twenty seven dollars now. We're so fucked. Oh my god.